got myself into. So these are Watt Water. Um, I found this brand on Reddit of all places, and I'll try to put a link to their website in the description. It was started by two guys. They were looking for an energy drink that had less jitteriness and less withdrawal symptoms compared to regular caffeinated energy drinks. And they stumbled upon a ingredient called Gaiasa. It is based from a plant in South America. Uh, the leaves are the source of the caffeine, so it's probably similar to tea. Um, they use it as their main component of caffeine throughout all their drinks. Apparently, pound for pound, it is uh, less caffeine than uh, coffee cherries, but it does offer a milder kick and less jitteriness compared to coffee. The nifty thing about this uh, drink is they're in tablets. They, you know, add your own water, I guess. And you can add it to either water or, you know, flat water, or still water, or sparkling water. And each cube technically makes 500 mils of liquid, but you can add more or less, um, depending on whether or not you want to make it sweeter, or, uh, you know, either you want to dilute the sweetness or intensify the sweetness. And uh, another cool thing that you can do with this is you can mix and match flavors. I do have one word of warning though, if you are going to use sparkling water, the reaction is violent. Uh, I tried it once indoors, and uh, fooled me once, and then I did it outdoors, and this is the f footage of what happened when I did it outdoors. I think I lost about, I don't know, maybe like 30 mils of liquid, if that. Okay, um, so there are five flavors. Uh, I don't know if I have them in order. But, uh, according to my script, they are, uh, oh, I'm sorry, I forgot to mention, I, I ordered this online and it came with a, uh, a padded sleeve and I think it's mineral glass, uh, 500 mil, uh, flask, if you will. I mean, it works. Okay. Uh, sorry, getting back uh in order so right now they have five flavors uh they have orange overload cherry charge raspberry rapids grapefruit galore and peach blitz now i like the alliteration that they have for the first four but guys you couldn't come up with a moniker for peach that started with a p you know like i don't know pizzazz passion pleasure um yeah so, as I mentioned before, you can mix and match, and I was thinking of doing that, but, you know, if you do the mutually exclusive, collectively exhaustive uh, mixing of this, that comes out to, like, I think 31 different combinations, and that's a lot more caffeine than I would like to do in one sitting, so um, I'll figure out maybe what two flavor combinations are, but I'm assuming... Uh, they're not going to be like, you know, super, um, different from a single flavor or all five flavors at once. Who knows? Maybe it's a Voltron kind of thing. Uh, okay. So I would have done a dissolving of a cube on camera, but, uh, I've clocked it at about 15 minutes and I usually don't make videos that long, so, uh, there'll be a lot of sitting and waiting for something to finish. So... Trust me on it, it takes about 15 minutes in cold water, and uh, I think it came out to maybe a little under 15 minutes for sparkling water. I haven't tried it for hot water. Um, I won't go too specifically into the ingredients, but uh, they are pretty much all the same, all five flavors. They use, uh, let's see, citric acid, gyasa extract, sodium bicarbonate, and so potassium bicarbonate. Those are probably the violent uh, effervescent that you see when you drop a tablet into water. Um, if you add it to still water, it, it is not soda. It just, it's just how they, um, well, I guess, get it to dilute into the water. Sucralose for sweetness, and I'm assuming vitamin C for 
preservatives. And the rest are just variations on their flavoring and their food coloring. Uh, very similar to that, the calculation is for 500 mils. That's about 16.9 fluid ounces, but they all have the exact same numbers. Zero calories, zero grams protein, zero grams fat, zero grams carbohydrates, and what I'm assuming is 0 0.05 milligrams of salt. Um, I don't recommend you try eating them. I did. It turns into what tastes kind of like salty baking soda, and it foams in your mouth. So, yeah, I don't recommend that. Anyway... From here on out, I guess, is the tastings. So, okay. Uh, first off, single flavors. We have grapefruit, cherry, orange, peach, and raspberry. Uh, I'm probably going to be using the miracle of editing throughout this. So, okay. Grapefruit galore first. It's pretty orange. It's even more orange than orange. But anyway, bottoms up. Tastes like a citrusy sweet tea. Uh, if you ask me which citrus, I wouldn't be able to tell you. Maybe slightly grapefruit, uh, like bitterness in the aftertaste, but it definitely has a tea-like taste. Okay, next up is cherry. Oh, by the way, none of these have any uh, egregious odor uh, being emanated from any of them, so. But up on the nose, it smells kind of like a tea. Anyway, you ever have like a candy or a drink that it's like a mixed berry, but you can't quite tell what berry? Is it strawberry, cranberry, blueberry? Uh, maybe. Uh, that's kind of what I'm getting out of this. If you told me this was cherry, I'd be like, uh, really? I'll have to take your word for it, but... No, I'm not getting cherry. Okay, next up is orange. So out of the three I've tried so far, this tastes the most orange, orange drink-like. Um, with a slight aftertaste of something like tea. That, that must be the Gaiasa coming out. All right, peach. It smells very sweet. Of what fruit? I can't quite tell. Hmm. Now this comes off as a tea first. Like, kind of like the tannins that you might get. The, the drying sensation. But, you know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of like a, a watered-down Snapple peach iced tea. Uh, a little less sweet, but yeah, quite reminiscent of one of those. Alright, and then raspberry. Probably the most candy taste out of the out of the five. Not sickly sweet. Kinda kinda like a Jolly Rancher actually. But it's it's not like a watered down Arizona iced tea. Uh the tea like taste makes sense to me, but uh it, it is quite sweet. And now, through the magic of editing, I'm going to be doing all sorts of uh combinations, so Hopefully I'll have it up on screen. You'll have 15 different combinations of the so. So, these cups are roughly 200 mils. This guy is, can count up to 50, so I'm going to do 50, 50 of each, and then pour it into this guy. Okay, uh, I'm not going to do finger snaps and all sorts of wonderful things like that, but uh, yeah. Uh, here we go. Through the wonders of editing, you might see something else. What I think the best combinations were. I had the chance to talk to one of the guys who created it, and they are coming up with uh, different ideas. I, I won't go into detail because they're still, you know, developing them, and I don't know whether or not they'll actually come out. But, you know, choose for yourself. Uh, I'm living in... Japan right now, and I think they're based out of either the UK or France, because uh, I think they're produced in France, but they do ship worldwide, and because they are just tablets, I mean, it's just these little packages, uh, you're not paying exorbitant amounts for shipment, 
because you're not dealing with liquid weight, uh, you know. Like I said, uh, I just glanced over the ingredients that they have, and uh, on their website they have much better descriptions of what they've included in their drinks and what kind of benefits it has to your body. So, yeah, uh, want water. If you can, give it a try. Uh, I really recommend them. Okay, till next time, the drink's on me.